So all of Russia is frozen all year round. I'm just kidding. No. Uh, the weather was fantastic. Uh, you have all four seasons. A lot of people think of Russia as like this frozen wasteland, right? With bears roaming the streets and penguins, you know, everywhere. But the summertime was beautiful. I'd get, at least in Samara, I'd get 95, almost 100 uh, Fahrenheit in the summertime. Um, you'd be sweating, wearing your short sleeve shirts, going around. It was gorgeous. Spring and fall are just like they should be. You know, you thing of spring and fall like you get spring and fall in Russia it's not like I mean I grew up in Nevada where it's you get summer and fall and summer and fall and so that's about it but you have all four seasons um the winter does get pretty cold I think the coldest I got was about negative 25 uh so you need some pretty good warm clothes but as long as you've got a scarf good coat some gloves good boots and a hat on like you said um we go out in the cold for few hours at a time and we were fine you, you'll get good stories like coming in coming inside and your face is numb and your snot starts to thaw and you can can't even feel it like dripping down your face and it's fun you know it's a great experience um i would recommend getting boots in america the russian boots typically aren't as high quality you can find some good ones in america but get your coat in russia because you can get a nice warm coat they know how to make them right um that's just my advice, personal experience. Um, but yeah, I loved the weather. It was, you know, it got pretty snowy and pretty cold sometimes, and then it got pretty hot, but um, it was, you got to see it all. Uh, Samara itself is right along the river, so it's a little bit more humid, um, which was kind of nice, uh, kind of not nice. Sometimes you sweat a little bit more, you feel the cold a little bit more, but it's kind of nice to have some moisture in the air. So, yeah, it's, it's beautiful. It is a beautiful country, um, and I liked it. If you open your eyes and try to appreciate it, you will, because there's a lot to appreciate.